one son to the station wagon Let's all go Sunday go to meet in good time We'll be there early Get the crowds and kidding Play this show Monday to do to do to do We'll be there early We'll shake some hands and get to know Sunday go to meet in good time We'll be there early Look around and see who's missing Sunday go to meet and yeah Let's get together just to spend some time Forget the clock up on the wall Replace the pressure with some peace of mind Jesus has something for us all, yeah No need to try to live this life alone, no, no. We might find some strength in someone else Like heaven, when we get together, faces glow. Someday go to meet in good time. Now don't you worry, when we get to singing, blessings flow. I'm inviting you to let's fly, so clap our hands, y'all. Stomp our feet and close our eyes. Someday go to meet in good time. We'll keep the faith, Lord, and leave our burdens far behind. Someday, someday go to meet. Of another week of wine I'm thankful just to be alive I sure could use a miracle divine Cause I'd like to do more than survive, yeah that you came to Sunday meeting, you know. Um, that's an old Brian Duncan song. Some of you are familiar with Brian Duncan, and uh, you guys did a good job on that. And we're glad you're here this Sunday. We're talking about something called the church. You're in the church, but uh, at least the church building, but what does it mean to be part of the church? Well, that's what we're talking about this morning, and that's why they sang this song, Sunday Going to Meeting, and that's why we're going to all sing together this song provided for you in the program called The Family Song. For some of you, it may be a new song. For others, it may be a very old song. Um, it was written a long time ago. And there's one word in the song that I'd like to clarify for you, if I may. It's the word Abba. Um, a lot of times when you see a word like that, you might think, well, the songwriter just put that word in there because it maybe made the song go better. And it kind of looked okay, you know. But really, that's just a Hebrew word that means daddy. Like we say dad, dad at a very early age or mama. Um, it's a very simple expression of a little Hebrew child, whether it be a boy or a girl, saying to their daddy, Abba, daddy. And God not only wants a father relationship with us, and we hear the word father, we think more institutional, we think more strict, maybe a little bit more authoritarian, but he wants a daddy relationship with us. And so when you see that word and when you sing it this morning, it'll have maybe a new meaning for you. You'll have a better understanding about what it is you're singing. Let's all stand together and sing the family song. Yeah. 
don't you just turn around and just say hi and welcome somebody this morning. chatting about church in our church chat. And I'd like to start our time off this morning with a little scripture reading. And I know you all brought your Bibles, so if you would please open them up to Paul's epistle to the Ephesians, chapter 2, verse 19. Listen closely now as I read. <laughs> you are members of God's very own family and you belong in the household of God with every other Christian. Now, isn't that special? <laughs> We're all one big happy family. I'd like to take this moment to talk to some of you boys and girls out there that have not been going to Sunday school. Now, I want you to sit close to your TV so I can see you through my magic mirror. I see Bobby, 
and Janie, and Mary, and Brad. Now, I know that some of you boys and girls haven't been going to Sunday school every week, now have we? We all know what that means. You're just a little bit closer to spending eternity in damnation. <laughs> Let's try to do just a little bit better, shall we? Today we have a special guest with us. I'd like you all to give a church chat welcome to Mr. Jack Nicholson. Is it Nicholson or Nicholson? <laughs> Nicholson. Oh, we all make mistakes now, don't we? May I call you Jack? May I call you Miss Lady or shall I just call you Church? Church Lady be just fine. Or how about Preachy? Well, aren't we feeling just a little bit superior tonight? <laughs> Let's get right to the point at hand, shall we? Jack, do you ever go to nice places like church? I try to stay away from church as much as possible. And where is it, Jack, that a man like you might go to meet nice people and make friends? Well, I like to go to clubs and restaurants. Clubs and restaurants, and Jack, what is it about these clubs and restaurants that are so attractive? Music. I like the music. Music, eh? What kind of music might that be, Jack? Loud music. <laughs> loud music. I'm sure you make lots of friends talking over loud music with that pulsing driving beat while you're half sloshed out of your mind and probably gyrating your hips now, don't we, Jack? <laughs> what kind of music is it? You want the truth? You can't handle the truth. Rock and roll, lady, I'm talking rock and roll. Rock and roll. <laughs> and we know who's behind rock and roll now, don't we, Jack? Is it MTV? Is it those heathen gospel? Godless radio stations? I don't think so. Perhaps maybe it's, well, um, Satan? Well, I don't know. I've never met the man. You say you've never met the man. Jack, 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 Jack. <laughs> then I guess our audience is just dying to hear what it was that possessed you to be in that movie, The Shining. About three or four million dollars. So, it's money. Money, money, money. We worship mammon then, do we, Jack? Is mammon what you're serving? If you worship mammon, we know then that you're possessed by not Donald Trump, not Ross Perot. Could it be, well, maybe I'm sure it is Satan. Look, lady, I don't even know what mammon is, let alone how to serve it. Jack, 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 Jack. I really feel sorry for you, Jack. You seem to be trapped in this mode of greed. You seem to be trapped by worldly secularism. You need to go to church. You need to listen to Pastor Tim's message today on what the church can do for you. You need to join me right now, Jack, and do the superior dance to get started. Come on, Jack. Hit it, Pearl. Lady, I don't like to dance like a chicken with epilepsy. Why do you try to dance with the devil in the pale moonlight? Jack, are we being a spoiled sport? Jack, get back here! I'm not done with you yet! That's my staff. <laughs> it 
There was an article on the cover of New 